what up is your boy red and i'm gonna review hold on let me get this right dead and paranormal park right uh no netflix series i love it man it's actually i i enjoyed it actually i just put it on because it was one of those on my list and i was like wow pretty good show actually decent enough to keep my attention going good characters good messages i mean it has you know transgendered person on the show along with a lot of you know lgbt stuff it's a pretty good decent show i love these shows not because of that but because of what's going on the paranormal park they're working in a park that has ghosts goblins demons not basically demons and ghosts right and then there's an elevator that leads down to hell and it's pretty amazing the art style is great i enjoyed it and uh, I actually like the main characters. At first, I was like, I don't know, maybe they seem kind of generic. But you have Norma, the socially awkward person, Pugsley, the cute little dog with powers, Barney struggling with his family and then them accepting him. And of course, Courtney, the thousand year old demon who lives in the park and can't go home because she's been Aladdin, right? <laughs> you know, she has golden cuffs that she can't go back to hell with. Um, Overall, man, they're all pretty great characters. Probably out of my all these, my favorite. Well, not my favorite, but the one I was like, whoa, is Norma. Her uh, struggle with uh, people, crowds, stuff like that. And there's people like that, and I know they're all like that, right? And that's crazy to see that in the show. Because um, she works in a theme park, right? But I guess she struggles with that with every day. That's her curse. I don't know. Anyways, continuing on, right? So... You're like, what's the main plot here? They just work in a park, deal with the things that come up every day? Kind of, but there is something going on main-wise, right? Uh, besides the main demon who you first see in episode one, uh, his sister who comes out later on, and not to mention uh, the, the ending, man. The ending kind of brought up my score. I was like, it's a pretty average show, but it's fun, you know? Um, there's also a, mer a mer you know, mystery going on, you know, with the park, the owner of the park and stuff like that. That was pretty cool, too. But uh, the ending really got me. I was like, I'm definitely, there's a season two of this show. I'm definitely going to watch it, right? Uh, the angels and stuff like that. Um, Music-wise, it was pretty good, you know. The music was decent. There's one episode where they do like a, what do you call it? A musical. And normally I hate those. Unless the music's really good, and uh, the music was actually pretty decent in that musical, and it kept me, I'm like, man, that, that episode was kind of, kind of, kind of cool, right? Um, other than that, like I said, I've seen this before, a uh, story, you know, where it was going, I kind of knew where it was leading up to, and the ending, could have predicted it a mile away if you've seen any kind of cartoons like this, but I just like watching them, you know, just putting them on, see if they're any good or not. This one's pretty good. Uh, there's many others like this that are really good, pretty decent, right? Nowadays for Netflix cartoons, this is pretty much what I expect, and one, this is what I got, right? Um, definitely gonna make fan art of this, <laughs> just cause it's fun and easy, right? Um, like I said, hopefully we get a season two. A lot of Netflix shows are, you know, some are good and then they don't get a season two. Hopefully this one does, and I'll re I'll watch it, right? Um, I enjoyed it and see where it goes especially with the relationships building here um you know different characters falling in love love to see that and no matter what gender i'm doing crap it's good to see that stuff in shows um as for what possibly happened in season two i'm guessing the angels will come down because there was a lot of hints going on about the angels um especially with courtney's braces they're not demonic braces they're angelic braces so there's a lot of things going on in the, in the background and we're going to see what happens and hopefully we get some more wacky adventures with our group here. And Pugsley, my boy Pugsley with his little good boy hat. It's always great to see. Um, but other than that, man, it's a pretty decent show. Uh, how many episodes? Ten? So you get a good amount of episodes, right? Ten? That's basically what your Netflix show is. And they're pretty long, right? Um, like I said, show is average, but I'm going to give it a seven out of ten. Just so that ending kind of brought it up for me and... Uh, Thanks for watching. Uh, hit that like, hit that sub, and don't forget, merch down below links. Check them out, man. Peace.